no such thing as ghosts. It's just something that Gran made up. There's no such thing as... Granddad? No. No, 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 no. I can't do this. I can't do this. I've got to run. Was that him? I can't do this. Oh! Hiya! Uh, 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 hi. Uh, where did you come from? Inside. How about you? Uh, graveyard. Are you scared? You look scared. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm being chased. Chased? By who? The, uh, the... Ghosts. Nah. Sorry. No such thing. What? No such thing as ghosts. In my experience, anyway. D d yeah, but have you tried telling them that? That's new. What's new? What's that? Sonic screwdriver. No particle displacement. No digital glitching. My teeth don't even itch. They are... Ghosts. <laughs> Hello. I'm the Doctor. Friends call me the Doctor. Can we be friends? Okay, fair enough. Not the chatty sort. In that case, I'm going to take my new mate. Sorry, I didn't ask your name. Uh, uh, Ethan. Ethan Jennings. Nice to meet you, Ethan. Ethan and me, we're going back to his place. Want to come with? No, thought not. Come on, Eats. Eats? Tell me, how long have you seen these ghosts? There have always been ghosts in Stockbridge, my dear. At least as long as I can remember. Not on my watch. I won't have it. This is a lovely cup of tea, Mrs Jennings. Thank you. Oh, that's Ethan. Bless his socks. He does everything for me, don't you, lad? It's nothing you don't deserve. Graham brought me up. Now I'm returning the favour. Did you see him tonight, son? Him? Who's him when he's at home? Albert, my husband. He passed away three years ago. I'm really sorry, Millie, but I don't think that's your husband. Are the ghosts always in the graveyard? Uh, yeah, yeah I guess. They, they might go in the church, but... A church? You never mentioned a church, Ethan. You've got to take me there right now. I should be getting Gran to bed. No, you don't. Well, it's time to see if my Albert really is back, I think. Okay then. Me, Ethan, Ethan's granny. What a team! Come on. Gran? It's you, isn't it? Is that your granddad? Yeah. We can't linger, Millie. I'm really sorry. But something's wrong here, and we need to put it right. All right. Uh, wait for me, will you? <laughs> Come on, then. Let's get going. You ever been inside before? Uh, no. The place has been condemned for years. So no one's been inside. Funny, that. the light coming from? Good question. I've no idea. Hello. I'm the Doctor. Welcome, Doctor Ethan Jennings. I am the last of the storytellers. It, it's inside my head. Direct telepathy. Makes my teeth itch. Don't ask. I assume you're behind the ghosts. The stories of this place brought to life. What does it mean, stories? He's a storyteller. It's in his genes. The telepathy hypnotizes the mind like a... a... Hypnotist? Humanity grieves for its dead. How glad they are to see them return. You're trying to be nice. Oh, of course. A psychic imprint in a place like this. A place like this? Think about it. All the people who've come here to this church and left their memories for the storyteller to use. Memories of joy and grief and hope and despair. You must have so much material. It is a kindness. There's nothing kind about happiness. Do you really think so? Close your eyes, Doctor. No peeking. Tell me a story. Tell all of us, what do you love? What do you remember? Stars, I remember 
stars. The whole universe at my fingertips. Mayfly planets that exist for the blink of an eye. Galaxies that spiral into oblivion. And friends, good friends, family. And they're happy memories, all of them. But they're still just memories. Happiness is the change you make in the world. You've got to live it. That's what makes it real, Storyteller. That's why it can't be given away. And that's why you need to stop. Hello, Ethan. Did you see it? Uh, yeah. It, it was amazing. You have given me much to think about, Doctor. It is time, perhaps, that I moved on. For now, I will bring this story to an end, though it may not be an ending you like. Where will you go? Somewhere else. You have given me inspiration, Doctor. Do you really believe it, Doctor? All that stuff about happiness? He's still there. My Albert. Psychic imprint. Takes a while to fade. Does it hurt? Shouldn't even notice. Why'd you ask? Psychic imprint. She was part of the storyteller's fiction too. It was your story. I was meant to look after her, like she looked after me, and I didn't. What am I saying? She's just made up memories. Just because it didn't happen, doesn't mean it isn't true. Are you one too? Am I what? A ghost. How is it that you're still here, Doctor? How can you be real with your sonic thing and your psychic imprints and my gran made up? It's not fair, it... It's not fair. I'm not here to make things happy, Ethan. I'm here to make things better. I'm sorry about your gran. Really. <laughs>